Hi and welcome back, this is Messer and it's time to play Capitalism Lab on our quest for the, the fashion accomplishment on Im Jumel Impossible Challenge difficulty. Uh, last episode we accidentally uh, managed to push into sandals to opening in a factory in attempt to bur uh, produce uh, textile and cut them off the market. So actually it's quite good that we uh, we didn't open it and then just after that it was uh, cancelled. That would have been a huge uh, cost for us. Uh, so in one way this is good I guess. Uh, we aren't making money on the on the sandals yet. But I guess we will eventually. Uh, at least we're creating some brand awareness uh, for all the footwear products. So I guess in one way that's good. Um, yeah, uh, let's see, uh, how is our financial situation? We can take a loan of 4 million, uh, 4 million would be enough to open up a new factory, but I don't think we want another factory right now. Uh, what we want is to produce leather bags, and in order to do that we need textiles. Uh, let's see how our uh, leather products are doing. Uh, we could probably... Yeah, we looks like we will actually need uh, more leather welts and more leather belts. Those are the most profitable items we have. <laughs> kind of like the only items we have as well. Um, but it's also a bit weird because I mean we are at like 50% market share and we have this one split between two items. So we can at max put out one new uh, one new uh, uh, store, retail store for it. Something that would be good with it. Uh, maybe we should actually open up another leather store. But if we want to do that, then we would need to uh, open up a new uh, uh, wallet factory, it seems. And if we open up a new uh, wallet factory, we should probably open up a warehouse as well. So we are the only one purchasing leather wallets. And what is the limiting factory? Seems to be the actual production of it. <coughs> so what I'm looking for here is to see if there's like a leather uh, outage or something. Or steel outage, but it seems to be fine. Everything is fine. Uh, leather production is going dandy. And uh, we increased price, so... Uh, trying to get some people off our farm moment we seem fine with it though, so let's just get it to like 19. Uh, this is really profitable for us right now, so I think we can continue doing this for a while. 7 to 14. Uh, I mean they are basically paid for our training in this uh, farm, so that's good. Uh, sandals. It's a bit messy. At least we have R&D going for it, so in that way it's good. Let's really look at like leather products now in different cities. Uh, we definitely have a market share for these products. The revenue is kind of low. Uh, but I guess it will be better uh, as soon as the research goes up even more. That's when you can really start getting prices for it. Uh, we are somewhat losing this market share, in, at least in retailing, inside Panama City. For leather belts. Uh, the other things look good, I think. situation is like how oh, they are selling our products. I guess it's fine. And it's no biggie. We can increase this one a bit. One ahead of the uh, 
<laughs> the city average. Uh, we can definitely reduce uh, advertising for these. Let's see if we can see like brand rating, brand awareness, brand loyalty. It's actually going quite quite nice. Uh, yeah. So I think we can just. Uh, so that saves us 100k per month. See what it's like in Marseille. Looks like it's it kind of like the same here. Uh, so we reduced the advertising for it. So we have one. I uh, think we can actually start training some people. No, should not train people here. Uh, and this is looking solid. We are at like maximum spider bond. Uh, it's sinky.
population is declining. Purchasing power from the people are gone, so that's why they aren't purchasing as much products as they used to do. That's probably why we are uh, getting lower on money. Just reduce this training on everything. Um, let's see if we can make profit. Training there, no training there. See my firms. <coughs> good. Um, let's just run one month for this. So that at least uh, reduced the amount of uh, money we're spending. Uh, fortunately none of our uh, stores are making profit right now. It's not really because of anything. Think. Mm -hmm. 
Maybe they're at them in an aggressive price war against this. Okay, uh, thanks for watching guys. Yeah.